that a shooting star through the night sky or could that be a space debris flying by there is so much space debris created by humans every year that eventually come back down through earth's atmosphere there are 160 million objects orbiting the earth creating real concern for space flight to move forth the space debris can move at dizzy speeds of over 15,000 miles per hour these are speeds that you can see is there reason for concern does it affect humankind it certainly does let's take a closer look to see what we find if an astronaut's on the space station on a space to fix something at the space station to try and beat the clock that a piece of space debris is orbiting through space it could hit the astronaut tearing a hole in his suit now brace if you love the internet rely on satellites and a satellite is orbiting the earth on its daily flight a tiny piece of space debris traveling at dizzying speeds of 15,000 miles per hour on its path it proceeds when it hits a satellite it could damage it permanently knocking out the internet with any size of the space debris what is space junk and how does it come to be let's look at some examples as they fly by we will see this discarded launch vehicle is space junk also this old discarded astronaut glove can create a bump a dead space satellite is the trash i'm speaking of even tiny pieces of metal shot from mankind above when the space debris continues to collide, creating more, we can create a Kessler effect, so space we can't explore. A Kessler effect is when space debris continues to collide, creating an endless debris field. No satellites survive, no space rapidly leave the Earth to explore the universe. If we don't clear this jump, we'll be stuck on the surface of Earth. Is that a shooting star through the night sky, or could that be space debris flying by? There is so much space.